Okay, a lot of people hate removing wallpaper. And I got this call to remove some wallpaper, and I thought, what the hell? I'll show you how to do it. It's very easy. And we've got to remove all of this antiquated wallpaper. I started peeling some of it off. And you hear the wind closing the door for me. And there's two layers on. And so, I'm going to show you the easiest way of removing this. First of all, you're going to need a steamer. And if you think you're going to do it without a steamer, you're going to make a lot of work for yourself. You can go rent this steamer at Home Depot. It's a great steamer. And I'm going to... That's the name of it. It's an Earl X. There's the water reservoir. And you can see I got it at the tool rental at Home Depot. And it comes with this cord and connects to the steamer, which is steaming now, and you can see it. What you'll want to do is first score the walls. Let me show you with the score. And this is another Home Depot special. It's called the Paper Tiger. And the inside of this has the little teeth. And all you do, and you can see that I've already done this to the wall, is you'll take this and just go all over the wall. Don't press too hard, but there's a couple of, if there's a couple of, um, uh, uh, duh. <laughs> a couple of sheets of wallpaper, then you'll press a little harder. And if not, just, just go all over the place. Score the wall, go every which way. Make sure that the more holes, the easier it's gonna come off. Because, as you can see, I've scratched it up good, and the steam will get in, Behind that, and lift the wallpaper very easily. Okay, so I'm going to put this tablet down somewhere where I can work, and then I'm going to show you how easy it is to remove the wallpaper. We're going to start from the top and work our way down. The reason for that being is the steam that um, the unit emits from the wand, which is there, will drip down the wall. If you start from the bottom, of course, it's going to drip down and not do any good because the wallpaper is going to be above you. So you want to work from the top, work down. And I'll show you the magic, how easy it is through the use of how you hold the scraper. Okay, we'll be right back.